Where are they all headed? Cargo ships from China and Chile. Trains to Chicago and Atlanta. Cruise ships returning from Mexico and Hawaii. Trucks to Riverside and Phoenix. Car carriers from South Korea and Japan. International cargo from A to Z. Apricots, almonds, and airplane parts headed to far-flung places like New Zealand, Zurich, Switzerland, and Zamtang, China. All coming and going from here, your global connection, the port of Los Angeles. One of the busiest and most spectacular seaports in the world is anchored on the southern tip of Los Angeles. 7,500 acres of land and water. Over 270 ship berths. 26 cargo terminals. Docks. A major national cruise ship facility. Cranes. Rail yards. It's America's premier port, bustling 24 hours a day, seven days a week, bringing into the U.S. goods that we want and international trade that we need. Each year, the Port of L.A. handles hundreds of billions of dollars in cargo, more than 200 million tons of products and raw materials. Thousands of vessels from all over the world all here. Over 40% of the nation's containerized cargo flows through the Los Angeles County ports. So, raw cotton grown in Central California might be shipped overseas to become t-shirts made in China, transported back here to be sold around the nation. The Port of L.A. generates a huge number of stable, well-paying jobs. For example, over 47,000 people handle cargo and other port operations. And port trade and employee spending supports more than a million additional jobs throughout California and more than 3.3 million jobs across the U.S. The Port of L.A. encompasses a harbor rich in wildlife and natural resources. 75 species of fish. Nearly 100 species of birds. Water so clean that kelp forests grow up to three feet a day. Los Angeles was the first port in the world to introduce alternative maritime power, or AMP, for cargo ships, plugging them into shoreside power at the dock. With AMP, every day a ship is docked, one ton of air pollution is eliminated. The port's unprecedented air quality improvement programs include development of new technologies, like a short-haul, heavy-duty electric truck that can haul 30-ton containers. These cutting-edge systems will help the San Pedro Bay ports of Los Angeles and Long Beach reduce port-related pollution by roughly 50% over the next several years. Other environmental efforts include wetlands and habitat restoration, like the port's $100 million investment towards wetlands restoration efforts at Batiquitos Lagoon in North San Diego and more recently, the Bolsa Chica wetlands in Seal Beach, two of the nation's largest wetlands restoration projects in recent years, and protecting nearly 1,000 active nests of the California lease term. The Port of L.A. is also a world cruise center, hosting a million passengers destined for Mexico, Hawaii, and exotic ports worldwide and the port is home to Southern California's emerging LA waterfront, a popular destination for visitors. Today's Port of LA is a global trade center, 
connecting Southern California to markets around the world. International trade enriches lives in many ways, bringing goods and services that contribute to our quality of life. Trade creates competition that leads to innovation. It improves economic benefits for emerging countries. Every day, people around the world use and enjoy the products of international trade. From A to Z, almonds to Zamtang, China, computers to Kalamazoo, machinery to Malaysia, teddy bears to Toledo. The Port of Los Angeles is your global connection.